Yo, hello everyone and welcome back to a brand new video. In today's tutorial, you will learn on how to unlock the synergy of AI by connecting ChatGPT to Siri in 2023. The step-by-step -step tutorial will guide you through the integration process, allowing you to leverage Siri for advanced conversational AI interactions. So guys, let's get started. Before we start with this video, make sure to watch it from now till the end so you have the full information. So, the first thing guys is basically to continue with me on this tutorial, you will ha you'll have to get uh, an iPhone. So as you can see in front of us, we have an iPhone. This is my iPhone I'm working on. So to start with, the first thing that we need to do is to actually get ahead and install ChatGPT in our uh, buy phone. To do that, simply just head up to App Store and here click on the search button and search for ChatGPT. And here click on Get on the first one. Click on Install and there you have it. Guys, make sure that as you can see, this application requires iOS 16.1. So if you don't have 16.1, uh, as like your own app on your device it will not be installed so that is the first thing to be to put it in your mind so how we can update your phone um, uh, like system simply by going to your phone uh, the, to the settings as you can see and here you'll find some suggestions and etc so simply you either can search for the update software update and here you will find the automatic updates and once like as you can see automatic updates on so that what it means that basically whenever my phone is connected to the charger it will be able to basically upgrade itself or update itself to the newest version that will be available uh, for me so as you can see here, there is the latest update, which is upgrade to iOS 17. You can go for it simply by clicking on download then in install. This is for installing or upgrading your uh, software so you can get to install chat GPT app. Well, let's say that we don't really want to install chat GPT and we want it to be as a browser, even that it's possible. But first, we have to make sure that Siri is actually uh, available in our mobile phone. As an example, let me check. Hey Siri. As you can see, it didn't really answer me. Let me quit. Hey Siri. As, as you can see here, it answers me. So, let me close that. So, how did I get to actually turn on Siri option on my mobile? So you might think that once you get an iPhone, it will be turned on. Well, this is not the case. You have to turn it on from the options or the settings category on your mobile. So go to here, search for Siri, accessibility in Siri. And here you'll find uh, all the options about Siri. So here, make sure to always uh, turn on this listen to for hey, hey Siri when your phone is facing down or covered this is something that you must uh, turn it on as well because it really do help um, here if you want Siri to announce your notification to you over your device speaker it can do the same thing you can choose which apps you want it to be announced as an example we can choose it to be uh, like calls or whatever uh, here we can find uh, some other things that we can do but it is not important for now just make sure that your Siri is turned on and that is the most important thing now after you are done with that you have to go ahead and ask Siri to open chat GPT so let's do that so hey Siri can you connect me can you connect me to chat GPT? Uh, it doesn't look as you heard it told me that it doesn't look like I have an app named chat GPT but I can search for it on the App Store so hey Siri or I, I should wait a little bit so hey Siri can you open 
can you open ChatGPT in the browser? So let's wait a little bit. Can you open ChatGPT in Safari? So this is some examples of how you can connect Siri to ChatGPT. So now it can open ChatGPT on the web for you. It's very easy, guys. Uh, you just have to say whatever you want and it will basically take you to the website. You can even specify it more by saying, Hey Siri, can you open ChatGPT website? on open ai i am sorry i didn't see it didn't catch that let me just type it let me just type it maybe because um let me just type open chat gpt chat gpt on safari uh, by going to open the ai so here it is and there it is so this is it is the first link that will appear to us chatgpt.openai.com so here basically if you are logged in into your account already and everything is set up you can literally make it ask questions and write something in the conversation that can be a little bit harder since you are using it on your browser but guys as i said if you updated your device to the latest version and you got the latest iOS version, you don't really have to get the latest iOS version, at least the 16.1 version, then you will be actually able to update and download the ChatGPT app, which will allow you by consequence to allow Siri to ask directly ChatGPT for anything. You want to cheat in your exams, basically Siri can do that for you. You just have to tell it, hey Siri, can you open ChatGPT for me and ask it, uh, for example, for what is square root of five or something like that. Then it will open ChatGPT for you real quick, ask it, and it will give you the answer back it's very very easy guys to use it so guys with that we have arrived for an ending to our video it was very easy very straightforward there is two ways to actually connect siri into your chat or chat gpt into your mobile siri it is either by downloading the app by going to the app store or by going to the Ch open ai chat gpt website url so that was it for today's video guys, I hope you enjoyed it, if you do have any more questions make sure to leave them down below in the comment section and thank you guys a lot for watching.